Now, this is where we We belong here. This is is our time. It's our chance to speak out. To talk back to public television. I'm James Randi, speaking on behalf of Professor Paul Kurtz, Chairman of the Committee for Scientific Investigation of Claims of the Paranormal. Founded in 1975 by a group of scientists, philosophers, and specialists to provide a possible alternate answer to psychic claims. Among these founders were astronomer Carl Sagan, behaviorist B.F. Skinner, and authors Isaac Asimov and Martin Gardner. The committee has always appreciated NOVA's excellent contribution to the public's understanding of science. We were thus deeply disturbed by the case for ESP. Though the first part of the program was well balanced, the second part went beyond standards of careful documentation by presenting highly controversial and disputed studies of apparent paranormal events as if they demonstrated the existence of supernatural powers. This excerpt shows a Russian so-called psychic who was able to cause small objects to move about. This can be performed by means of a fine invisible thread connected to her costume. It is something that only a magician can be expected to detect. Now, for parapsychologists to tell us stories about selected successes while ignoring requirements of documentation and careful analysis is not science, it is pseudoscience. And NOVA viewers should be made aware of that fact. We of the committee have always believed in an open-minded approach to these claims. But in view of the lack of substantiation and adequate replication, we believe that NOVA has made a very rare error in the program content offered.